Did you know that all four of the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles have each been voiced by over 15 different actors? Spanning across multiple animated series, movies, and video games, the franchise and its many characters have been reinterpreted by, at this point, hundreds of different actors in total. Although with as many different voice performers as there are, you might be even more surprised at how much crossover there's actually been between the casts. To start with, going back just a couple years ago to 2014, after the release of the first Michael Bay Ninja Turtles movie, two video games were released based on Hollywood's new big-budget take on the Turtle team. In these two games, Cam Clark reprised his part as the first voice of the team leader Leonardo from the 80s series. Come on, Turtles! The fate of the world depends on us! The best leaders always lead from the front. Like you need any excuse to scarf pizza, Mikey. And Cam also played not Rocksteady, who we also voiced in the original 80s animated series, but this time Bebop in the Brothers Unite game, giving Cam another first honor of having played both Bebop and Rocksteady in different incarnations. What boat should we swipe? We gotta do this scientific like. Told you you should be seeing me again, chumps. Time for B&R's Top 10 Countdown of Pain. Moving ahead a couple years later, the platinum-developed video game Mutants in Manhattan featured another new cast for the Turtles and their many allies and enemies. The voice of Raphael from the 2007 TMNT animated film from Imagi Studios, Nolan North, was featured in this game as Leonardo, Splinter, and Shredder. He's also the voice of the entire alien race of the Krang in the 2012 Nickelodeon animated series, as well as their version of Agent Bishop, making Nolan to have voiced six different iconic characters from the franchise. Mutants in Manhattan also featured Fred Tatashore, reprising his role as Rocksteady from the 2012 Nickelodeon series, but this time with a different voice, as well as playing Slash. <laughs> you mutate me into giant talking rhino? Yo, Bebop, let me in on a fight! Say your fresh titles! Fred has performed Rocksteady with now two different accents, New York and Russian based on his original human form in the 2012 series, Ivan Steranko. Most recently, Rocksteady could be heard being portrayed with an Irish accent in the second Michael Bay Ninja Turtles movie, where he was played by Stephen Seamus Farrelly. And you're a... Uh, I don't know what you are. I like it! The cast crossovers continue in a recent series of shorts produced by Nickelodeon, created by different animation teams, each with their own unique cast of the Turtles. But yet again, there were more than a few familiar voices. Turtles Take Time and Space featured two different Michelangelos, both reprising their respective versions of the characters. Greg Sipes as the modern Mikey and Townsend Coleman as the classic 80s Mikey. This short also featured Eric Bauza, known as Tiger Claw from the Nickelodeon Turtle Show, as the voice of Leonardo. And on that note, Bauza also voiced Donatello in the short Don vs. Raph. Mikey, you have to stop eating all of our pizza in 10 seconds. Raph challenged me to a fight to prove me and my inventions wouldn't be enough to save me from his... Uh... This short featured its own unique cast of the Turtles, but also included Matthew Yang King as both Splinter and the Shredder, the latter of which he'd previously portrayed in the 2013 video game Out of the Shadows. Patience, Leonardo. Your brother's pride will soon give way to understanding. Let us watch. This is the dumbest thing I have ever seen. Finally, the short Pizza Friday, which was co-written by TMNT co-creator Kevin Eastman, featured Yuri Lowenthal as Leonardo, who had also previously been in the Out of the Shadows game, but as Donatello. What the heck is Interstellar? That doesn't sound plausible. Ooh, speaking of which, Donnie's actor from the 2003 Four Kids Ninja Turtles animated series, Sam Regal, played Raphael in this short. And I was under the impression that this battle armor was for your self-defense out in the big bad world of 2105. What the... Fix this, Donnie. No! Perhaps the funniest bit featured in this one was April, who this time was voiced by Kevin Eastman's wife and manager, Courtney Eastman. This is officially the worst idea in the history of ever. We're gonna get caught. Shifting over to the new Nickelodeon animated series, which started in 2012. In the past couple years since our last video, a whole slew of new trivia has popped up. We previously mentioned that Seth Green had taken over for the part of Leonardo after Jason Biggs and Dominic Catrambone. But we didn't mention that not only has Seth played a parody version of Leo in a sketch on his series, Robot Chicken, prior to getting the part, but he'd also played Raph, Splinter, Casey Jones, and the Rat King in another sketch that had aired only a couple months before Seth's first episode as Leo in the Nickelodeon series. 
Mikey, Raph is going to be super ticked if we watch the Krognard finale without him. Splinter, are you eating garbage? What? Ew, gross. This shouldn't be sitting around, so I'm going to take the garbage out and uh, you get back to your lesson. During the same month as that Robot Chicken episode airing in June of 2014, another funny overlap happened, but this time on purpose. We've talked about Nolan North's many roles in the Turtles franchise, but we forgot to mention that the episode Plan 10 features a direct reference to Nolan's portrayal of both Raphael and the Krang, where Raph accidentally switches bodies with one of the Krang aliens, having Nolan's voice come out of the cool but rude red bandana wearing turtle once again. You are so smug! You know that? You think the world revolves around you, don't you? That we couldn't possibly survive without the mighty and powerful for Leonardo to guide us to our problems, huh? One called Raphael. The Nickelodeon series has also featured a massive number of new special guest stars, some of which are playing pretty significant characters from the Turtles mythos. Roseanne Barr as the Krang Prime, Gilbert Gottfried as Krang Subprime, David Tennant as Professor Honeycutt, the Fugitoid, Peter Stormare as Lord Dreg, Lance Hendrickson as Zog, Michael Dorn as Triceraton Commander Mozar, Michael Ironside as Triceraton Emperor Zan Morin, John Hader as Napoleon Bonafrog, Jim Piddick as Lord Simultaneous, Graham McTavish as Savanti Romero, Ashley Johnson as Renette, J.B. Smoove as Bebop, Dwight Schultz as Worm, and Zelda Williams as Mona Lisa, just to name a handful of the many more. There were also a few more clever throwbacks to the previous Turtles incarnations. Renee Jacobs, voice of April from the 80s series, appeared in an episode as April's mom, Mrs. O'Neill, and Robbie Rist, voice of Mikey from the original live-action trilogy of Turtles movies, played opposite to the new Mikey in the form of Mondo Gecko. Move it, will ya? Oh, you let him blow right by you! Can you believe this guy? Dude, that name sucks! And I'll make you pay for it! And finally, all four original Turtle actors from the classic 80s cartoon returned to play opposite to all four of their modern counterparts for the special episode Transdimensional Turtles, including as an extra bonus, Pat Fraley returning as the voice of the 80s version of Krang. Not wanting to miss a golden opportunity, this episode also, of course, featured a quick scene of Rob Paulson talking to himself as both 80s Raphael and 2012 Donatello. I think I'm going to like putting some more cracks in this imposter shell. <laughs> and you, Gabby, why do you sound so weird? Me sound weird? Heard yourself lately? Thanks for watching. This video was inspired by Did You Know Gaming, so go check out their channel and watch all their videos about gaming trivia. Special thanks to Omadon for the audio mastering, OC Remix for all the kick-ass Ninja Turtles remixes, and BehindTheVoiceActors.com for all the audio samples. If you like this video, check out our other ones linked here on the side. And don't forget to like and subscribe if you want more. Cowabunga!